Good morning, girls. Happy day two of our three-day digestive reset. I woke up pretty early today. It's 7 a.m. and I'm ready to rock and roll. I really wanted to hit the gym before my busy day, so I wanted to wake up early and get that out of the way um, because it, as the day goes on, I get less and less motivated. So it's the first thing that I do. I put on my workout set. I've tried to find a cute one. This one is from Bandier. Day two breakfast is smoothie we called it just smoothie so that's cute because everything has just one word you'll see it in the plan we've digesty smoothie tomorrow's toasty i'm getting things in pretty set up because i'm going to take a photo normally i would throw it all in the blender but content Pineapple, half a banana, handful of spinach, ice, 10 mint leaves, amazing for digestion, half a squeezed lemon, coconut water, and two scoops of our protein plus. It's got friendly and tastes like kick batter. Oops. You guys, there's really no better texture than our protein. It always comes out like ice cream. Mmm. It's not chalky, it's creamy. It mixes with any combination of fruits or ingredients. It's crazy, like this has mint leaves in it and it goes so with, with mint, with lemon. It's insane, but this is so good. It's a different combination than you girls have probably ever tried. So I'm excited for you to see if you like it. Mm. So we're gonna go to the gym now and I'm gonna pack my snack with me because I don't know how long it's gonna take me I don't know if I'm gonna go somewhere afterwards. So our nutty snack, which is blueberries I'm gonna pack it all together And some cinnamon which is antibacterial for our stomachs Girls, we're ready for the gym. I'll put my hair up when I get there. I'm honestly feeling a little tired right now. So I'm gonna make little glowing greens to go, which is also really good. The thing's about digestion, but it is really good for digestion because there's tons of fiber in it. There is caffeine from green tea, so we're gonna have a really good workout. And, um, there's a lot of vitamin C for immunity and brightening our skin, which is always great. So I'm just putting orange juice. I love orange juice. If you girls are following the plan, use glowing greens um, whenever you need a little energy boost. Kind of supplement it for your coffee is what I do. We don't have it listed in the plan as like when to take it, but I have it before workouts or like if I need an afternoon, pick me up. I'm gonna do 45 minutes of some mat work and maybe a little bit of walking on the treadmill. The most important thing is not what you do, it's just that you move for 45 minutes. So that's what we're doing these three days, is 45 minutes of movement. I'm gonna do what feels right for my body and that's what we're gonna do now. So I love to do a combination of like Pilates, dance, boxing. Let me know if you girls want me to do some more workout videos. Cause I feel like I finally understood how to be toned, long, feel good in your body. So now you really do what feels good and I love the results that I've had.
It's such a good combo. Mm. Wow. Girls, we are about to put on our soothing stew recipe, which is what we're gonna have for dinner. It is so easy to make, you girls are gonna be shocked. But it takes ideally eight hours to cook. So it's a stew, the slower and longer we cook it, the better. So it's morning time right now. I still haven't had lunch yet, but I'm putting on my stew so I can have it ready for dinner. Some carrots and white carrots. You can also use potatoes, the recipe you'll see in the plan. But pretty much all we're gonna do is chop up the vegetables, take a big piece of meat and put it in the pot. I started eating this stew when I was super sick with a stomach virus and it was the only thing that I could eat that didn't hurt my digestion and so it's so good for our stomachs. It's nourishing, it's warm. I know a lot of the recipes on this three day reset are like summery, but the stew is cozy, warm, nourishing, just comfort. This is the piece of meat we're using. It is picanha. It's just a big piece of high quality meat that I get from like a local butcher. in our pot. I added a few potatoes and put the big piece of meat in. Now we're going to put a bunch of salt. I put three big teaspoons of salt. Salt, yes, will be important. It's going to get all the flavors extracted. And water until it covers everything. I need a little more water because I need to cover the meat. That took me maybe three minutes to put everything into the pot. The quickest, most impressive dish. It's so good. We're gonna have it with maybe some sourdough bread, cozy watching a movie. It's so soothing on our stomachs and so nourishing. I would consider this a low simmer. You see where there's like tiny bit of bubbling happening. I'm gonna just check and stir it. Every probably like one, two hours, but it's not necessary to stir it. And let that simmer. I'm gonna do some work things now, but I'm super energized. Like I am like, whoa, I am so energized. I'm feeling amazing. Um, I'm organized. I feel like ready to take on life. So that's just an example of how a good foundation of health will just make everything in our lives flourish. I work from home, I have my brand fit with Cambry. I do everything myself, that's media and community talking with you girls. So like I have a backend team that runs the operations, the logistics, the customer service, and then in the numbers and like ads and all of that, but I edit everything, all my videos, DMs, comments, Instagram, it's fully me. I used to have people that used to help me and it just was never the same. I feel like it put a barrier between me and you guys. Like it just wasn't fully me. So I didn't wanna show you guys my lunch cause it's a leftover chicken tinga from yesterday and I don't feel like you guys need to see me eat again. So I just wanted to show you a little bit more of like my work life. It's all about organization and management when you work from home or you're an entrepreneur, it's all like, for me, I found that all my success is in like the details. So I have like a very intense Google calendar color coded with all my appointments, my Zoom calls. Um, I have scheduled posting times. I have certain hours of the day that I post, certain hours that I respond to DM, certain hours that I brainstorm. So it's all very organized and that's the most efficient way for me. So right now I'm editing today's video because I want to get it up as soon as possible. And I just feel so much more focused and energized. Like my brain doesn't have the fog. I know it's only been one day, but I'm not kidding. Like I feel drastically different. Um, and I'm also working on a project, projects that excite me and that I'm passionate about. So I'm so thankful for that. And I'm so thankful that I can do what I really love. And I'm just ecstatic. I am. I'm an ecstatic. So I have a Zoom call now. I'm working on something called Woman Empowering Women, which is
is my latest project. It's these wellness trips that you girls might have seen me been doing. I did one in Aspen, one in Ibiza, one in Mexico. And so we're gonna plan another one for this year. Um, and pretty much we just get a bunch of like-minded women together to support each other, to cross promote. And it's been so successful, like really. Okay, our stew re reveal. It's been cooking more than eight hours. You can see the water went down a lot. Let's see how it shreds. Oh my gosh, it's like butter. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. No. No, 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 no. No, no, no. It's cozy time. Okay, so I just finished watching the series, This Is Us. I loved it so much. Mm. Oh my goodness gracious. This is what every single night of mine looks like. I love to decompress on the couch. Like it is my favorite activity. It's my comfort zone. So we're gonna watch a show. Mm. I also have the sourdough that I'm gonna have a few pieces of dip in the stew. I need to get it super soggy. And the best thing is you can have leftovers for days of this. And everyone loves stew. I've never seen Scope even so eager for any meal. Mm. Today was such a good day. I love the structure that this plan is giving me. It's helping me really become the best version of myself. Like, actually. I'm doing better in work. I feel better. I feel like I look better. I'm excited. You know, sometimes in life when you just need something to like jumpstart you, that's what I needed so bad. And I just feel super inspired. My digestion, out of the world. Maybe we should watch Disney. Oh, yes. My boyfriend's not here right now and we always watch like intense things, like boy things, like Game of Thrones, which I do love Game of Thrones, but I wanna watch like something super girly right now. We're watching so shallow, but I need something super shallow right now. I've been thinking super hard all day for Fit with Cambry. And I want something super shallow, shallow that I don't think about anything, that I just disconnect and I become like a little zombie in a cozy situation. So I'm watching High School Musical. They made a series. So it's none of the same actors from the original movies. Exactly what I needed right now. Mm. High School Musical series is actually really good. I'm not being dramatic. It's filmed like a documentary style. So it's like very stylistic. And the kids are super talented. Let's go Scopus. Come on. I have a little bit of bread left. Sit. Down. At nighttime, I get a super strong urge to snack, like while I'm watching TV. It happens to me every single night. And it's just like a habit or a soothing thing that I've just always loved having. So, but it's something that I wanna have like control over. I'm not, I don't wanna be a slave to my snacks. I love snacks and I have them all the time, but for the point of this reset, I really wanna just like reset my habits and reset like my body. So. What I'm gonna do now instead, cause I'm super full. Like it's just more of like a, a board thing. So I have a few techniques. I get a water bottle and I have 
I have these lollipops that are vitamin C pops. Cause it's just like an oral thing. Like I think I used the pacifier too long when I was a baby or something and like I need something like in my mouth. So I'm gonna get two of these. Oh, I want the strawberry one. Let's see what flavors we have. We have watermelon. I'm such a watermelon girl. And strawberry. My dream. My dream. And if, obviously, if I was hungry right now, I would definitely eat more stew. But it's not. It's not. A, that's not what's happening. So. And then I'm gonna get one other thing. What should we get, school This is so exciting. Um. I think I'm gonna just get a little bit of dried mango. I'm not gonna bring the whole bag because I'll actually eat the whole bag. I'm gonna put it in a little bowl. We're so cozy. Yes. I think I have a really reactive stomach and everything for me happens in my gut. So like when I'm stressed, I get bloated, I get constipated. When I'm traveling, my digestion gets thrown off. Like I used to have all these problems in life around my digestion, around my bloating, and I would feel so uncomfortable and I did not like it at all. The bloat for me has changed my life. I know it sounds so dramatic, but it's so true. I feel like I found freedom again in life because now when I go out with friends and it might be late at night or there might be foods I'm not used to, I just take too deep bloat and I can enjoy. Before I get on an airplane, too deep bloat. Before a date night, deep bloat. Like it's just something that has really changed my life because I've found freedom in enjoying life more now because I'm not worried about my digestion. So. It's insane for me, like how effective it works. Even for like swelling, when I notice like if I have too much salt or if I'm hormonal or if I'm stressed, like I hold on to water and I feel puffy. Like all of that has toned down so much since I started to taking deep bloat and I take two of them every single day since for the last five years. And the results just cute. They've honestly changed my life because my confidence my self-esteem really is tied to my digestion i don't know if that's a good or a bad thing but it is what it is and so it's better than just living and suffering with that i just found a solution and she's here in a bottle not for you hmm which one should we try first let's try watermelon So good. Super good. I think that's Olivia Rodriguez. I think that's Olivia Rodriguez. Is. Yeah. Oh, Olivia Rodrigo. It's so funny. I wonder if this is how she started her career. I had no idea. That was such a fun day today, girls. Thanks for joining me. I can't wait for day three tomorrow. I'm feeling so good. And my whole goal is that I inspire you and I give you the tools to become the best version of yourself with the plans, with my videos, with content, with my products. So if you're looking for more and you want more, um, you can check out my website, my Instagram, DM me. I respond to every single DM. It takes me a long time, but I do it. I comment and it's me all the time there. So I love you guys and I'll see you tomorrow.